What? Tuesday nights. Today we have a live interview with Hard Rain. Hard Rain. Uh, what it do, what it do. Okay, and today will be a raw, raw footage, no editing done, raw questions. Are we ready? You ready? Alright. Shoot. You are a native from Altadena, correct? Definitely. Altadena, California. 626, we on the map, we own. Right on. All right. And my first question to you, going straight into these questions. Would you and have you ever worked with a pla Pasadena blood? Um, no, I've never done it. Um, and I never will. Um, pretty much, pretty much. I think that there's been so much blood loss, so much things going on on both sides. There's so many bad memories and all that. And I just couldn't put my people through that. I can't erase though. I can't bring those scars back. I don't want to bring that back to my people or none of that stuff. So, um, yeah, no, I can't do that. Um, okay, you know. moving on to the next question, Norris. Uh, I heard you had there a fight broke out at one of your shows a few months ago at the Dragonfly. How do you handle situations when it happens at your shows? Um, do you when take it's an sides? A Boy Entertainment function, I mean, there is only one side, A Boy Entertainment. Um, <laughs> pretty much. It's my show. I'm the security, and the people that I bring in are my security, and um, they're definitely they're my homies, um, people I trust. Um, so yeah, if you're at a show and you're being disruptive, you're going to be neutralized just as quick if you started that disruption, and we're going to be back to entertaining the people that we came to entertain, um, so you can leave that bullshit at the door. Okay. You know? Uh, next question I have for you is is that how you are just at your shows or what about um, the times that you guys go party with your homies your friends your homegirls do you are you do you not engage either or um you know when I'm out with the homies and all that we just out chilling and all that then you know um, something go down then I feel bad for you because we all in fall in but I'm talking about we whoops like homie niggas is whoops you better watch out <laughs> <That's> <laughs> real exactly. talk Real talk. Okay, and uh, you do have a song that 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 speaks on both blood and crit. Your song, "This Is the Land." Yep. Yeah, um, this is the land, pretty much. Um, it's an anthem. It's a West Coast anthem, pretty much, and it's telling motherfuckers, you know, you come from out of town, homie. You get done in by the blood and the crips. Um, it is what it is, you know. So are you just excluding bloods? I know I asked you this earlier. Is it just bloods or Dina natives or how do you? Um, per se, um, I'm more into the more the Dina bloods and all that. Um, you know, it's just too much. Like I said, um, I ain't got nothing against them per se. You know, nigga, do what y'all do. You know, I'm too old for that bullshit. Run up on me, we got that. But other than that, no. But um. Bloods from other areas or whatnot. Yeah, what about I mean, Pasadena you know, artists themselves, though? The artists themselves definitely hit me up. You know, send me some tracks. Um, you want to do some tracks with me? Um, hit me up. Hard Rain Three Gmail. I'm here. I'm available. I'm with that movement. I'm Dina. You know, I'm just you're just not, not with, with the, the bullshit. Blood. And with I'm the not bullshit. gonna bring my folks into that because you know we can scream unity all day, but you know, um, it'll never be peace. Like, and we know that, so we're not gonna play that and it's sad but it is what it is you know um you know about my music with it so all right so i'm gonna I'm a play a little part of your verse here because i know i know i'm and this is the land that can you sum up the song what it's pretty much saying um it's pretty much saying you know um on the west coast these crip niggas is with the business you know what i'm saying these aldina niggas is with the business and um it's pretty much saying that the bloods out here is with the business and um, you come from out of town and you hollering that bullshit and you gonna get the business i mean you know as simple as that Okay, I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and play a verse from sure. from This Is the Land. If you can go ahead and 
we'll emphasize a little bit on that when it's over. Because, uh, again, you have a blood verse. I, I, you're giving another point um, of view here. Yeah, I did that. I definitely had to do that. I had to, um, as an artist and a lyricist, I decided that I wanted to rap from a different point of view. All right, well, here goes your chance. Let's hear it. But I'ma give another point of view Not to be rude, see some niggas want the game bang Some red gloves, but fuck you up Bad stone, be your fucking face Cali's the place where niggas catch a murder case We hood boys, hood raised, tying on flag Nigga, we sagging, we play with 44 mags Nigga, we smashing, we represent the hood, low We represent dog, nigga, this the West Coast You come from out of town, nigga, you can witness this This ain't no limit, you can get your fucking life clip These game bang niggas raised in the fucking slum So watch your mouth, nigga, don't be asking where I'm from I'm from the land of the game banging dope slang Where you can die by the blood or the crip gang the land of the The rules in the motherfucking clip car. These in the streets, I got the creed of a hood nigga. My pair of green race thugs and some drug dealers. Don't fuck with me, this is the land of the clips and dog. The soul rules in the motherfucking clip car. These in the streets, I got the creed of a hood nigga. My pair of green race thugs and some drug dealers. Don't fuck with me. Okay, alright, alright. I definitely love that. That was that's pretty much saying you come up this route, you're gonna get fucked. You come up, you run up, you get done up. That's it, and that's all. That's it's up. Moving on to the next question. What did you think of the controversy between Major James and Little S? I know that he has a song called Salute. What was your um, opinion on that? What What would you, what advice really you... There wasn't really a controversy about it. It's more so people's personal feelings or whatnot. Um, Main so homies' personal feelings or whatnot. And, um... You know, what advice do you give Major? I'm going to though? tell my little homie this. I love you, my nigga. I support your music. Um, it's like this. Um, I don't know the connection between you and your folks and all that. And um, he good. Your song is great. That motherfucking song knocks. And um, I always want you to influence you to do what you feel necessary to do in life as Major James. Fuck with anybody else got to say any haters and all that. You do you, my nigga. Do you. If you want to work with a nigga, work with a nigga. Just know that with that comes people's feelings and how other people feel and all that. And they're going to express those feelings. But you maintain you as a grown man, my nigga. And you do you. But understand that sometimes, you know, these is the people that we love on this side or whatnot. And sometimes it is feelings involved, my nigga. So understand that mm -hmm. sometimes when people say things, they're saying it because they feelings is hurt or whatnot. To keep that in mind too. Um, phone's ringing off the hook. Um, okay, uh, let's get on to the next question. Uh, with that said, though, you were there at the video shoot. Um, no support. No, no support, support from what side? No support, whatever. Um, Major James has a gang of fucking homies. He has homies. We deep out here. We deep. Trust me. We deep. Um, and I feel like it was too many bloods at the video shoot. And understand this, y'all. People can say what they say, but Major is the homie. And he should have had homie support there because just because he's cool with this particular nigga that he's doing the song with doesn't mean that these other blood niggas is cool. And these niggas could have been on some other shit. And it's sad to say, but it could have been that and the little homies was there by themselves. King Yak, represent my nigga. I seen you. I was there too understand that. King Yak TV coming real soon. This nigga's funny. My nigga off the hood. You got that. So let me get this straight. Yeah. Major James did not have any homie support other than Yak, yourself, and a few homegirls that I saw. And a, a, a homegirls even from Do Rock was there, but... Yeah, there was a few people there, but what? What's, what's five people to fucking 30 people? And it's you major feel? song featuring a little S, not uh, S featuring major, right? Don't quote me on that. I'm not certain. I'm not sure. But um, definitely um, he's on the song. So he's on the song. You know the support has to come. So homie love, where's the homies? You know the A. Hey, stand up, man. Stand up. Right on, right on. Um, okay, and I'm going to throw out some names of some uh, artists from Pasadena and let me know your true opinion. We're going to wrap it up after this, this part right here. Mm -hmm. I'm um, just throw out some names. Um, have you or will you ever work with Zoniac McGee? And I hope I pronounced that correctly. Um, Zone. Um, 
Not personally, I haven't worked with Zone. Um, I've heard a few of his tracks. I think he's a great artist and whatnot. And he definitely supports A Boy from the beginning. I recognize that and I love that real recognized real. Um, but no, I personally have not, but I wish bro nothing but success. So okay. Mm -hmm. What about Filthy Factor? A filthy Factor, I don't personally know him. And um, at the same time, same thing, wish you nothing but success, bro. Um, do what you do, man. Um, we working in the same business, same industry, so, you know. Okay. Here. Let's you know, take it up a little more to the top, to the hilltop. Um, is there in, I know you and Crimstone are pretty close. Is there any works, any projects for the um, near future? Yeah, there's a lot of projects um, planned and things. It's from the hall with me and him, so um, we have a lot to do. We have a lot to work to do. We have definitely a lot of work to do. And, uh, Crimstone, check him out, YouTube, my bro, follow me. Um, okay. And then my last artist that I personally have been listening to for years, and I love his music, Scipio. Posted in the A, Scipio Bang, Scipio's hard. Um, I like that. Um, personally, I never worked with him, but we move within the same circle, same thing from the same establishment. You know, we all on the hilltop with that one. Is he so, one of your artists you want to work with in the near future? Um, definitely. I mean, you know, if he wishes to work with me, I'm here. I'm willing to work. Same thing. Um, you know, we all in the same business. Like I said, we all represent the same movement and whatnot. Um, let's get it. We got now. Okay, and we're going to wrap it up here at Able Entertainment, Able Entertainment's Hot Seat Tuesday with Hard Rain. Uh, let me make sure I, I crossed out all my questions out here for you. Um, any shows coming up lately? Um, right now, we're working on a lot of technical things, um, learning a lot of things, and we're working on a lot of mixtapes and a lot of projects that A-Boy has going on. Um, shout out to DJ Highlight, you know, for working with us. You know, let's push this, you know. DJ Highlight, hood stories coming soon. Indeed, another mixtape. Uh, A-Boy Entertainment mixtape coming so soon. So there is an Altadena mixtape in the works. There's definitely a mixtape in the works. There's a lot of things in the works going on for Altadena. And there's a lot of things going on for A-Boy Entertainment, Third World West. And for Hard Rain fans out there, can you uh, let us know the name of your mixtape? The name of my mixtape is Burdens and My Convictions. Um, Favorite check song? out number three, third track, bottom oh. to the top. That's a music video coming to that soon, correct? Video coming soon, a lot of things coming soon. We own this shit, bottom to the top, exactly what it says. We doing this shit. Check me out on Twitter, Hard Rain TL. Check me out, Facebook, Elijah Hard Rain, the lyricist. Check me out, hey boy Entertainment, Twitter, www.aboyentertainment.com. I do oh, have one I mean. more question for you before we leave. I know there's two other A boys sure. from A boy. Oh, original, original Alter Ego. It's my bro, dope lyricist, gifted. TC, T Caltadina, my boy. He's on. Philly, check him out on YouTube. T Caltadina, deal with depression. Oh. Right on. Check him out. Yeah. Like the 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 I the 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 with my brain and Gouda. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine, don't be wasting time, dude. Get up and get mine,